All right, if you're looking to plan a big vacation, you may be able to put Europe back on the list. The European Union reportedly working to welcome vaccinated U.S. travelers as soon as this summer. Most non-essential travel has been banned for more than a year now, but as 12 on your side's Marilyn Moritz reports, vaccinations are the key to easier travel. Their trip to San Antonio complete, Al and Pam Silsley wouldn't mind seeing Italy or Paris. Yeah. Love to go. Yeah. Would you consider going as early as this summer? Yep. Heck yeah. They may be able to. The European Union will welcome fully vaccinated American travelers this summer, according to the New York Times, who spoke to the president of the commission. I would expect there to be a huge surge in new bookings. Uh, uh, for Europe travel this summer as a result. Travel expert Scott Kai says that's what happened when Iceland and Greece opened their doors. So how will the countries know if you've even been vaccinated? Well, that's where the so-called vaccine passports or certificates come in. Countries and the airlines are discussing how to implement them. Keep your white CDC card in a safe place. Make sure you don't spill anything on it. Make sure you don't lose it because that's going to be your pass to be able to visit Europe and other places this summer without having to have any negative test or, or, or quarantine upon arrival. Besides paper, they're looking at apps to show your proof on your phone. But with big demand, will there be deals? Kai says yes, because airlines will add flights. Now he says you can book a summer round trip from San Antonio to Dublin, Ireland for $353 and a round trip flight to Spain, $526. The EU has not given a date for reopening, but because summer tourism is huge there, Kai's expects it will be soon. Marilyn Moritz, KSAT 12 News.